Hey, everyone. Hey. This is Movie Pillow Fights, where each week Stacy and I take one movie question from Twitter and we answer it. And yep. sometimes we fight about it or we just kind of discuss it. Yeah. So, and uh, sit we here pretend to fight about comfortably. it. Comfortably. Can I just say this is pillows. my favorite thing we've done for our podcast? Yeah. yeah. I'm so comfortable right now. It's exciting, isn't it? How, <laughs> what do you guys think? Are you enjoying it? I don't are know. Are you guys all about this? I mean, are this you is like our third this one? Is dumb. Yeah. So, yeah. Anyway. Third one. Hey, I'm uh, Brienne, also known as Miss Movies. And I'm Stacey Howard. We have a podcast called Six Degrees of Feature Film. Yep. Which you can find on iTunes, SoundCloud, Stitcher, and on YouTube. So subscribe, Thank please. You. Subscribe to this channel. That's right. Yep. This one. Yep, Not this one. someone else's. No. This one. Well, if other people are cool, I guess you can subscribe to theirs. True. Yeah. We have some YouTube friends, so you can, yeah. you can subscribe to theirs. But ours too, though. Ours too. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Because we're sure. small. We're a small organization. Yeah. Small organization, us. small and tight unit, but we're putting the word out That's there. right. What's yeah. our question for today? Our question for today is a good one. This is something I've talked about before, and I love asking people this question, because it's always interesting answers. Uh, Kevin on Twitter asked us, who inspired you... To love movies what person in your life introduced you to them and made you realize that this is something that's gonna be a big part of your life it's a great question yeah um, okay so for me it's my mom mm -hmm. she definitely introduced me to classics like Alfred Hitchcock we would definitely have days where we would watch movies in her room and um, I don't think she was the one that got me the first video camera, although technically it was the family video camera, but I mm -hmm. took it over, because that's okay. what happens, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. um, I'm sure my dad was more the influence on the video camera side of it, and my mom was on the movie side of it. The only thing with my mom now is she will spoil movies for me. If, I, if she calls and is like, have you seen this movie? And if I say no, or even if I say yes, she'll just go right to the spoil mm -hmm. of it, and I'm like, mom don't so <laughs> so she doesn't have the spoiler etiquette down mm. but she really is the reason that I like film and I don't think she realized like how much that would mean to me mm -hmm. you know mm -hmm. I mean I did work at Blockbuster though so that obviously like you know you're a film geek yeah. you have worked at all Blockbuster all the best people video. do all the best right. people work Hector. at Blockbuster yep Hector Myself. did Yes. Paul Shear. Yes, what? from How Did This Get Made, one of our favorite <laughs> film podcasts. The best. That's right. For sure. What all about you, you Stacey? Uh, okay, so, well, first of all, I worked in a movie theater, so I feel like that's okay. also yes. the, that's on par. That's the second uh, job that you can have, right. besides blockbusters, if you like, uh, like films. But my older brother was who inspired me. Growing up, he's five years older. We have complete polar opposite personalities, didn't have the same friends, didn't do the same activities, you know, didn't do anything together, never got along. But movies were the one thing that he would let his annoying kid sister tag along to. You know, so if it was like, you know, a Sunday, like he'd wake me up, you know, and be like, okay, let's go make pancakes and we're going to watch Raiders of the Lost Ark. This is important because it was right after Star Wars and, you know, Harrison Ford wanted to be introduced. It's, you know what I mean? Right. Like he would explain the importance of the film and why it was incredible. And so we would watch... You know, he got me into, like, the big franchises, and, you know, we loved Lord of the Rings together, and um, I loved films like The Mummy I would drag him to, and so just these these great movies that are good family films to watch together was really what we did, how we bonded, and how we still right. do. That's still what we talk about all the time is movies, so... Yeah, yeah, big bro, holding it down with mm -hmm. little mm -hmm. sis, just watching film. He let me watch movies that my parents didn't allow me to. So, like, if they yeah. were out of town or away from work, he'd be like, let's watch Eli Roth's Cabin Fever. There's lots of blood in it, and there's this funny scene where she's, like, shaving off her leg oh, and, like, dear. all kinds of crazy stuff. That movie gets crazy. Yeah. There's a <laughs> finger bang scene. Okay, well, scene. Uh, hold on. Okay, okay. Let's okay, stop here. Okay, stop. Okay, all right, all right. I don't want to go too much <laughs> No spoilers. Okay, yes. okay. Fever, no spoilers. No spoilers. Right. Is your mom in the room? Is she spoiling the movie already? <laughs> um, it's you. <laughs> it's me. <laughs> Mask off. I'm your mother. <laughs> Just kidding. So yeah, yeah. There are I think there's someone in everyone's life that kind of introduces them to film. Right. You kind of like pass the torch. You do. You know, you, you let you the do. next generation know what is up and what they should be into. So Who's that for you guys? Yeah. Comment below. Let, let us know. know. Oh, <laughs> bye bye. Yay! All right. All right. Give us a like. Oh. For sure. For sure. Um, yeah. This week on our show, guess oh, what? Yeah. We got John Bailey. Whoa! The one and one. John Bailey. Epic voice guy, friend of the show, incredibly nice guy. He's from Texas, just like me. 
what yeah. all the best people come All from the best people Texas. come from Texas and work at Blockbuster. That's right. That's or right. We talk about Shawshank Redemption, so check that out. Yep. Mm-hmm. All right, guys, that's it. We'll Thanks. see you next time. Thanks. Bye. Bye.